Yo guys, what's going on? And it is me, Simple Order here today. And uh, today I'm just gonna be showing you my survival world. Uh, it's just you know a world that I play on whenever I'm bored. I used to have one on PC, but that was on my old PC and then I lost on my flash drive. It got corrupted, so I decided to make one on Xbox. And uh, I don't know when I started this, to be honest. But I started it not too long ago, probably like at least like two weeks ago. And uh, I just want to show you this because I don't know, a lot of people show off their survival worlds. And I just want to show you guys this because it is coming out pretty well, as you can see. Uh, this is like the farm type of building, and also this is gonna be like my house. Kind of like, let me show you. Let me go up here. Watch out, dog. This is not even my dog. Push him off. Oh. Uh oh. Alright. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm the only one that worked on this world. I only got my friend Steven to help me get some wood for, like, probably, like, one tree. And, uh, so you walk in from these doors from the left side. You got this, which you can see from down here. And you can also look up. There's probably going to be a bunch of chests lining up. Uh, so it's gonna like help me organize stuff because that's what I like doing in Minecraft organizing it sand wood dirt uh, Certain ores iron diamond stuff like that got a lot of windows too because it is probably gonna get really dark in here So I put a lot of windows and then I got like a little balcony that You can see off of it's pretty nice you can see like the main portion of it because I am going to spread like as you can see I'm bringing out dirt and everything all throughout this desert biome I was gonna show you my plans later in the video but hopefully next time I'll do another video of course probably like a month from now and I'll show you how the world is I'll probably do that like every single month I show the world so I got a crap ton of sand from clearing it out as you can see <laughs> I don't know, it's just random stuff, basically. Some more sand, a lot of paper, stuff like that. Uh, coal, tons of it. Uh, I do like mining, and definitely I found a abandoned mine shaft, which definitely has a lot of ore, stuff like that. Redstone, iron, stuff like that. I only got uh, 11 diamonds, but I think in total on this world, I had about 28. But, you know, I used it for tools and stuff, used it for... Mm, enchantment table, just a workbench. I think I'm cooking some uh, sand because I actually need it for the skyscraper that I'm working on. I actually have to refill it. Just a little bit. I don't, I don't really have a house yet, like a nice house. I might just build that for show because nobody really uses the house. Because I'm just gonna be putting all my items in here, stuff like that. This is my air um uh, my god <laughs> it is a lot of sounds so this is mostly just my cow farm as you can see a bunch of cows actually maximum amount of cows here I chickens but I was used to PC where you could just have like infinite everything so cuz I mostly do a chicken farm pig and a and a uh, a chicken, a cow, and a pig, but I only did cow. I took all the chickens away. So I don't know what I'm going to put in this. I uh, really can't put anything. So I might just put, like, wolves or something in there. Something nice. This is in my mind. I'll show you that later. This is the farming, oh, farming building. Mostly just all the farming stuff. I don't really have carrots in here, though. Which I don't like. I got to make a separate thing for carrots but I have wheat I have melons on the side I was actually gonna make this skyscraper so there's a bunch of floors and it's all farm but I was like eh, I'm not gonna need much farm since I can only have a certain number of cows so I just made it one story and then I added the resource the organization on top of it and then I just have another farm outside I enabled fly on so I can show you guys the world a little bit easier make makes it easier for me and for you guys this is just you know wheat I uh, wheat <laughs> what are they called again I forgot the name of them reeds sugarcane yeah 
Sure can. I'm used to reads from the old Minecraft. But, um, as you can tell, I haven't touched this farm in a long time. Last time I touched it is to make this. Which was, you know, a little thing that I made. So I can enchant stuff. But that's the last time I touched these. Probably never going to touch them again. But, yeah, they're just there for show, basically. And then I already showed you this. And I made all of this stuff, you know, grass. As you can see, there is dirt underneath it. If you guys didn't believe me. I don't know if you guys didn't believe me if there's dirt underneath it. But I want to make this whole portion inside these, uh, this cobblestone. I want to make it all grass. And then I want to make this all grass as well. But this is just kind of like the main area right here. That's below this cobblestone. And then I'm going to go all around the portions that I want to use as land. Try to get away from the beach area. And just go all around it with cobblestone. As you can see, I made it up to here. But I'm going to go all around this little island side. Uh, probably stop until I reach like right here. And block it. Yeah, probably like block it right here. I'm probably going to make bridges and everything to this portion of the sand biome, stuff like that, because there is some plains biome over Oh, what is that? Is that like a natural pillar? Oh, no, I made that. Right. That was to mark my stuff. But, yeah, this is my portion of it, so hopefully that works. Now, this is the skyscraper that I'm working on. It's, it's taking some time, mostly just a lot of glass. And a lot of wood. We'll see how every skyscraper goes. I'm happy I'm done with the side woods. Mostly I had a bunch of wood. So it wasn't that big of a problem. But now I'm starting to get low on. Uh, you know on wood. I have a ton of sand as you guys saw. So I'm good on that. I have a ton of coal to burn it. So I'm good. I just got to worry about the wood. Because it is pretty annoying cutting these trees down. And I'm just leveling this out too. Because this was actually a gigantic mountain. I don't know if you guys can make out how big the mountain was here. But I think you guys can imagine it was pretty big. I could probably get the original seed and check it out. <laughs> but it was pretty big. I also found the surface mob spawner. I don't really know like any ways to, you know, grind on it. I probably have to find out, if, you know, the power of YouTube. But uh, I'll find out that later and that will definitely be shown in the next episode. And guys, this is not where I spawned, by the way. I actually spawned in the jungle because I'd probably say 50% of this, a mm, little bit over 50, a little bit over 50%, this map is jungle biome. Uh, I know it might be hard to believe because you guys just seen the sand and stuff, but is that, it is, that, oh, there's my map. <laughs> it's actually like a little bit over 50 percent jungle and that's not all the jungle right there that you see on the map there's plenty more but i haven't wanted to explore it on this map i have made like a new map just to explore i didn't want to do it on this one mostly because it can update and later updates uh, of any you know stuff like that but it's pretty just an e it's an easy path back to spawn all you have to do is just go straight so it's not that hard of a path follow all right yeah so we're coming across it right here as you can tell it looks pretty dumpy there is actually a bunch of trees here you know I cleared it out I was actually gonna make this like the place that I was gonna live I was gonna clear out this mountain as you can see I was making the outline for it and everything I was gonna clean out this clean out this whole entire thing but I started exploring a little bit, and I found freaking plain biome, sand biome. I was like, I was just going to build all of that. So, I mostly got all my resources from this cave. Let me see if I have anything in these furnaces. No, I don't. This cave right here, as you can tell, I had a little organized path. Because as I said, I was going to make this like my permanent living space. But I decided not to do that. And let's see if we can get to the mine. Because I'm pretty sure... I made a path all the way down to the mine. Oh yeah, here it is. As you can see, the little pillars that they usually have. And then I took all the fences and everything out. I have signs so I know where to go. And then you can see the little abandoned mine shaft stuff. It's cool. And then I also had a little house. I was going to build a little guest house. As you can see, it looks pretty dumpy. 
pretty small. Stuff like that. I have like stone tools in here. I don't really know what I'm going to do this episode. I just want to do it to show off it. But I do want to do some stuff. Just to, you know, entertain you guys. Not always just show the world. Because there might not be any updates next month. Or there might be a, a ton or, you know, not that much. And I want to be that entertaining. So this episode, I'm, I'm just going to show you the world. Show out is really, I'm not going to, you know, play or anything. But next episode, I promise... I'll show the updates to the world, and I'll play a little bit, and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like if you enjoyed, uh, give me any suggestions of what I should build, what I should do, stuff like that, help me out a little bit, and uh, I always cut out the part where I say adios, so I'm just going to say adios on this, adios.